friends welcome back to my channel or if you're new here my name is Olivia or Liv whatever you know we prefer um so today is gonna be a pre-trip Disney World haul um we leave this this video was up Sunday and we leave this Friday we're doing a weekend trip just to Magic Kingdom um I wanted to go it'll be able to at least go for a little bit this year since my original trip my big trip got postponed uh, or canceled I guess I should say because we don't know when we're gonna be able to take that now um so yeah, so I wanted a quick little weekend trip, so I've bought a lot of stuff for this trip. I've bought more than I normally probably would, but we're taking our godson who's four, so I wanted to make sure I had everything for him. Um, also, these ears are from Magic Mountain Ears, I believe it's what it's called. I'll link it down below. They're from Etsy. These are like 3D printed. They're really comfortable and cute, so yeah. So let's just get started. We've got a lot of things here. So first off... We've got some Mickey Mouse goldfish here. Um, these I bought because, like I said, we are taking our godson. And he is four. And obviously, you know, if he gets hungry, he wants food then. Let's be real. So, um, in case we're in line for anything or we can't stop at the moment, um, I've got those. I'm going to throw them in a Ziploc baggie and he'll be good there. Um, sorry if I'm reaching behind me. I've got stuff all around me. The second thing I bought are these ears. You will not believe how much I paid for these guys. They were only $5 at Walmart. $5. Um, and they're sequin like little peppermints. And then they've got a plush green bow. And they are pretty thick. Um, the back is like the reversible sequin. Um, I'm going to turn them all white. I just haven't done it. They've been laying in the bag. Um, the next thing I have is this bag. I think I'm going to put all of our toiletries in this. Um, but it says you've got a friend in me. Um, it's from the Ulta... Pixar collection. I actually bought this on Black Friday because it was like $10, so it was really cheap. Um, and it's got cow print. Um, I love cows and cow print, so I had to get that. Um, so we're going to go on to the next bags here. Let's see. Yeah, this is toiletries and also other little snackies. Um, I bought the Go Go Squeeze Apple Packs for him because, you know, duh. Um, let's see. I'm going to pull all these out. So the first thing I have is my husband's deodorant, just the men's, whatever, and then my deodorant, um, I normally use the secret, if it'll focus, the secret gel, but it doesn't want to focus today, there we go, but this is supposed to be better for, like, sweating and stuff in the heat, so I figured we're in Florida, so might as well, um, I bought my shampoo, conditioner and mouthwash um there's more toiletries in this bag but you know it's just a hot mess right now after i film this video i'm gonna go ahead and start like pre-packing certain things um speaking of the zip out bags for the goldfish i bought the pixar ones of course we're going to disney so how to get pixar and they have toy story incredibles monsters inc and um, cars on there um, this is kind of random. Speaking of, one of the bags fell out, but Toy Story. Um, I showed you that backwards. I'm a ding bat. Toy Story. Um, speaking of, like, toiletries, I bought these extra large, let's see here, if it'll focus, extra large cleansing cloths. These are just really good, um, especially with a four dollar if you need to wipe them up. And if you just feel, like, gross, um, in the park, you know, you can run the bathroom just freshen up because... I'm a firm believer in that because it's Florida, it's humid, it's sticky, and if you don't want to go back to the hotel, it's a great alternative. These, um, I actually bought when I bought the Walmart ears, and they're little Mickey, or, yeah, Mickey Santa little dangly earrings. These were $5 as well, um, but let me show you the coolest part about them, if I can get it. There we go. I'm only going to do one, but... They do light up, so I'm going to be, like, all Christmased out um, at the parks because I'm going at Christmas time. And, yeah, so I thought that would be fun. Get that off now. Um, the next thing I bought, this was actually for our godson, Zayden. Um, but we discussed, it said it was for a toddler, but this is clearly way too big for a toddler. This Lion King drawstring backpack. So I actually bought him a Marvel one instead. Um, that's just some junkie throw in here, but I actually bought him a Marvel one instead. It's like a kid's like actual backpack for the park, so that is what we'll be what he's taking because he told me he wanted a backpack, 
for the park. So, you know, we'll see if he actually carries it, but it's there. Um, the next thing I bought are these Vecan six pack of six, um, packing cubes. I actually haven't opened these yet. Um, let's see here. Um, these are from Amazon. I actually bought these because the Leffersons had them on, like, their travel essentials from, like, on their Amazon storefront. And I love the Leffersons, so I trust their judgment. Um, I was going, I have packing cubes, however, mine are, like, really old and not that great, like, sturdiness or anything. So, I went ahead and bought these. So, um, just this is the front one. Um, and they are labeled, like, this one is for bras, panties, socks, apparently. And then the other ones are just, like, all in here. Um, I'm not going to take all of these out yet because that's a lot of work to do. So, yeah. I figured that would make it easier so I can pack, like, my clothes in one, my husband's in one, and then Zayden's in one. Just to, you know, keep it a little organized. Um, the next thing I bought, this is for Sunday's outfit. I'm going to do Hercules. I've got a Hercules shirt and ears. And then I've got these earrings. Um... Sunday is our travel day home. However, we are going to Steakhouse 71 for lunch and probably like going to explore the um, contemporary and stuff. So I wanted another Disney outfit. I've got these Hercules and Meg earrings. And these came from Ash Grove Boutique. Um, and actually, I found these as well through the Leffersons. Um, and one of their magic mails, um, the boutique had sent Alyssa stuff. So, I absolutely had to have these. I will try to link these down below. I can't remember if they're still available or not. Um, but if there's anything you guys see in this video and I don't link it down below, just to ask me and I'm sure I can find it. Because sometimes I'm bad about remembering to link it down below. Um, and then the last thing in this giant bag is this Stitch. Let's see here. Stitch Christmas shirt. Let's see what it says. Mary Stitch Miss Kinsey. Um, this is obviously for Zayden. He wanted a Stitch Christmas shirt, so the kid gets what he wants most days. Let's be real. Um, the next thing I bought this on Black Friday as well. It wasn't on sale, but there was free shipping. And if I cannot pay free, if I cannot not pay shipping, I'm gonna do that. So um, this is a Disney Vera Bradley. It's the I think it's it's not on here, but I think it was like the Sensational Six pattern or something. But it looks like this. Um, as you can see, there's a bunch of hidden Mickeys in it. And then we're going to open the inside here. And I've still got the packing stuff in it. But it's got this print with the Mickeys. Um, and you can't really tell it right now, but it's an electronic travel organizer. So I can put all of our cords in it, our external battery packs, our battery operated fans, all of that. Um, so that's why I bought it. So, I should be able to link this down below as well if it didn't sell out. I don't believe that it did sell out. Um, because like I said, it wasn't on sale or anything. Next thing I bought, these are just in here. Um, I'm obviously going to take these with us, but they're just glass cleaning wipes because, you know, I have glasses and those are important. Um, uh, the next clothing item here is for Zayden as well. I bought all of his little shirts off of Kohl's, I think. Um, yeah, they're the Jumping Bean brand. Sorry, there's fuzz on it. And it's just the old Simba shirt. Um, the Lion King is his absolute favorite. So, I picked that up. And this one's like a little thermal. Um, I know it is Florida, but it's supposed to be in the low, or the high 40s, low 50s at nighttime. So, if he wants to throw that on instead, because, you know, kids are unpredictable. Um, and then I bought Liquid IV because can't go anywhere without these. I don't use these just in Disney, but I use them, like, even here in the summer in South Carolina because my body sometimes is not good about staying hydrated, even as, if I drink a lot of water. So, these are a lifesaver. I bought the Guava ones. This is actually one of my favorite flavors. Um, the next thing I bought here is this Star Wars Mandalorian color and decorate on the go kit. Actually, I didn't buy this, um... My husband's aunt bought this for Zayden, but it's in here because we're going to take it with us. Um, he loves Baby Yoda and Star Wars and, you know, it's perfect because it's in like one of these little cases and he can just clip his pictures here on a Baby Yoda. The next thing I bought is some 
super moleskin padding because, you know, you walk a lot in Disney and your feet might need it. Um, so for me this time, I get to rock a scooter. I'm kind of nervous about that because um, I know I've mentioned before I hurt my ankle. So I'm finally able to walk on it now, but I don't think I'm going to be able to put the all the weight on it all day, if that makes sense in Disney. Because, you know, it's like 10 miles in Magic Kingdom, basically. So, I'll be running at ECV, unfortunately. But, thankful that option is there so I can still go. Um, I bought a Tide to Go stick. You know, you would think I would buy this for my godson's sake. Really, it's for me because I'm the messy one. Um, I also bought this Asper Cream with Lidocaine Pain Relief Spray. Um, in case my ankle does give me some fits. Because I will have to walk from... We're doing breakfast at... Is it Tratoya Al Forno? I'm probably butchering that wrong. My apologies. We're doing breakfast there at 7.30. And so I'm going to have to walk from where our Uber dropped us off into the restaurant on Boardwalk. And then we're going to take the Disney buses to Magic Kingdom. And then that's where I'm going to run my ECV. So in case my ankle was like on fire and can't handle it. I bought this. And of course for anyone else who might need it in our group. Um, the next three things. I'm going to pull all these out together here. I bought us Disney water bottles because, of course, I did. And all of our water bottles are massive, so I wanted something a little bit smaller. Um, these are from Simple Modern. I have some of the bigger ones, and I really like their water bottles. The first one is this Jungle Book one. Um, and it's just the same print all around. And um, it's just a flip-up straw. What's nice about these, um, let's see here if I can open it, yeah, is they put um, extra straws in there. So, like, you know, after a while, these get kind of dingy. So, um, that's nice. And I believe this is a 16 ounce, 14 ounce, sorry. Um, so this one's for Scott, my husband. I obviously got the Rapunzel one. And it even has foot on it. Oh, if it'll focus, there we go. And same thing, just a little flip top. And the last one we bought was for Zayden. And it's just Lion King because, of course... Um, we're getting down to the bottom here, guys. And then, the next thing I bought is this little carabiner two-pack because these do have the little, um, ring on them. So, I'm gonna stick the carabiner on it and then hook it to my backpack so I'm not having to dig it out. Um, the next thing I bought is this little pill organizer, um, because I'm gonna show you how handy this is. It looks like this. Um, this is the big side. Obviously, we probably don't need this much ibuprofen. Well, we're not going to need this much ibuprofen. Um, but I just filled it up because I'll keep this in my travel drawer. And obviously, ibuprofen doesn't go bad. So, you know. And then this side just has like Pepto, like tummy medicine, allergy medicine if anybody needs that. Um, I've got my anxiety meds in there. And yeah. So, this was actually a two-pack on Amazon. I gave my mom the other one. But they're really nice and sturdy. Um, so I was really happy to get that. Let's see here. More toiletries. I knew we had more. Um, my husband's body wash. I bought a mini wet brush. Um, I always use wet brushes. They're my absolute favorite. So I picked up this one. Um, let's see here. Oh, here we go. I didn't mean to grab this. I meant to grab the toiletries. But we're here now. This is a gimbal that I bought for um, vlogging in the parks because, you know, instead of just holding it in my hand, I'm obviously not going to take a tripod. Your phone just sticks here. You can turn it on. It's also got a Bluetooth remote right here. Um, and the cool thing about this is it can also, like if we're sitting down somewhere and I want to show something and I need to be hands-free, it does have a little tripod. Um, and these are allowed in the parks. Um, I double check. So, yeah. Um, that was Amazon as well. Okay, here we go. More toiletries. Have some wet ones. Um, because we are in a pandemic, obviously. A lint roller. Basically all this stuff in Target or Amazon. Um, let's see here. Body wash. Dry shampoo. Some little flushable wipes in case we have any accidents with a toddler. And then this Welly 
quick fix on the go first aid kit and I got this because it's all <clears throat> sorry my throat's gonna it's all latex free and my body doesn't look like this so it's just really cute um let's see here I haven't opened it yet but we're gonna open it for the sake of the video so I can show you guys what it looks like if I can get it all open sorry I'll do the rest of that later um but it's first aid on the go in case we do have any accidents I am prone to clumsiness clearly as you know I hurt my ankle but it just looks like this um, it's got Neosporin, it's got Band-Aids, um, hand sanitizer, um, anything basically we can need, it's got it for us. So that's definitely a perk there, um, because yes, I know there's first aid in Disney, but you know, just in case it would take us a minute to get over to first aid. And then the last things I have in the bag, <clears throat> excuse me, are new magic bands. Um, let me unhook this is Zayden's and it's just a stitch one. Um, and it's actually from Milani, but he wanted stitch. So we got stitchers and then, um, actually Dis shop Disney messed up and sent us two. So my husband's actually going to wear the other one because they told us to keep it. And, you know, might as well save money on a magic man. And then I bought this one because I said I'm going to be rocking the Christmas. Um, let's see here. It's just the holiday magic band. And then my mom is going to use my old mint one. Because I actually never linked it. So, I say it's old, but it's really brand new. She's going to rock that one. So, yeah. So, this is a pretty lengthy video. My apologies. But that's everything I've bought for my pre-Walt Disney World trip. And so, this coming, um, I'm going to give a little bit of a schedule real quick before we go here. Um, I don't want to put out all of the Disney vlogs until after Christmas so I can put them out weekly in a row and there not be like a Disney video and then Christmas and jump around, you know? So this coming Sunday, um, will probably be, um, a pin mill video. And then, um, yeah, I'm going to do pin mill because I have a lot of pin mill stacking up here. Um, I'm going to do a pin mill video and then the following Sunday will be Christmas um, a Christmas vlog, and then after that, I will start the Disney World series. So, we did a travel day, day of the day we leave. Um, we did actually exciting enough, we did go ahead and pre order our cookies from Goody Gideon's at the one off Disney property just because we could pre order them and not have to worry about there being a super long line. It is the week before Christmas, so it's gonna be crazy busy. So, yeah, so as always, guys, thank you so much for watching. Um, I'll link some of this stuff down below if I can find it. And I'll leave my Instagram down below. And thank you so much for watching. I would really enjoy, um, appreciate it if you would subscribe and like this video. And as always, have a magical day.